How to use the WPS button on your Nighthawk router. Hello everyone. Today we're going to show you how to use the WPS button on your Nighthawk router. If you've ever wondered how to quickly and securely connect your devices to your Wi-Fi network without entering a password, this video is for you. What is the WPS button? Before we get into the how-to, let's talk about what the WPS button is. WPS stands for Wi-Fi Protected Setup. It's a feature that allows you to connect devices to your Wi-Fi network without having to manually enter a password. It's all about ease of use and convenience. Locating the WPS button. The next step is finding the WPS button on your Nighthawk router. Typically, this button is located on the back or the side of the router. It's usually labeled as WPS, or it may have an icon that looks like two curved arrows forming a circle. How to use the WPS button. Now that you know where the WPS button is, let's go over how to use it. 1. Turn on your device you want to connect to your Wi-Fi network. This could be a laptop, smartphone, or any other Wi-Fi enabled device. 2. Go to the Wi-Fi settings on your device. Look for an option that says, WPS push button, or something similar, and select it. 3. Press the WPS button on your Nighthawk router. You have to do this within 2 minutes of selecting the option on your device. 4. Your device will automatically connect to the Wi-Fi network. No need to enter a password. Remember that the WPS feature may not be available on all devices and it's always important to keep your network secure. That wraps up our tutorial on how to use the WPS button on your Nighthawk router. It's a simple, quick, and secure method of connecting your devices to your Wi-Fi network. We hope this video was helpful and you're now confidently using the WPS feature. If you have any other questions, feel free to ask in the comments. Thanks for watching.